Hello everyone, we Coach Bong here, and in this video, we'll learn how we can use Viber to effectively and quickly communicate to customers and groups. Ito the all-in-one Padlet, no? So when you go to the Padlet, and what I'll do now is I'll copy this. I'll go to our Viber. Mm. I'll put the link. Okay. And when I put the link, it will show you, oh, that's the Primus Excellence Center. Okay. So mm. save that. I'll, I'll, I'll pin it. Huh? I'll, uh, while nang sa Viber tayo, I'll just put some functionalities uh, that you may not be familiar with. You can pin something, no? So if you pin a message, it's now on top so that people, oh, nasan ba yung ano, nasan ba yung all-in-one Padlet? You can click at the top. So that's a way to save, uh, to, to have something important, easily accessible to the rest. The other thing, the feature of, uh, of uh, Viber uh, is the file section. So yung files, if you share a file with your team, with even family members, they stay in Viber and actually, mas kaya niya magpadala ng larger files, sometimes better than uh, company email. Yung company email, sometimes they, they limit the size. But in Viber, you can even send videos. No? So um, not unlimited, but relatively larger files than email can be sent. So here, you can see Pinos ni Ray, yung kanyang video. No? So it's a file that if you post on Viber, uh, uh, people can download. So I'm just wondering why this is not in the list of files of Viber. Is this, Ray, ano, um, a link? Was this uploaded on YouTube or something? Uh, no, sir. Ano lang po, uh, file from the phone. File from the phone. Because normally, I would expect it's here. In part. I would expect it's in the file section. So, maganda dyan, you can click on files. I'm just not seeing it here. No, so do you may time delay? May time delay because uh, Chuck posted here at 421. So mamaya baka makita natin. No? So it's a good file sharing tool. The other thing that Viber allows us to do is to make polls. No? Um, you, sometimes you would like to do a poll um, among the members of the Viber so that you can easily see where they are. No? So um, so let's ask a question. Are you finished with your WordPress blog? Okay. So for the poll to work, you put yes, and then you have to have at least two options, and then you create the poll. Okay. So while we're seeing this, can you, ano, can you just answer? I think you, you've done this before. But the nice thing I'd like to point is here, if you click here, you see those who answered no. Okay? So, uh, magkakaroon ka kagad ng sense. Kasi sometimes, if you just put posts and people like, limba if I like this, you don't know who liked it. Eh. So, you, you don't get a sense of uh, sino nga ba of the 22 participants here, sino na yung nag-like na yun? So here, we see, oh, si Tanya is finished, okay? So do take advantage of the poll feature of Viber. Ano pa? Okay. So um, this is my personal and professional Viber. Um, I, I, I take it now also to demonstrate how uh, companies are taking advantage of Viber to communicate now during this pandemic. So... Here, um, I'm, I, I filled up a, a loyalty card in Watson's. So I gave my number there. And there's a way for you to determine if the phone number is a Viber number also. Okay? So Watson's used that name to communicate to me to um, promote either their online or their call for delivery. Okay? So if I click here, this is the important thing about digital. It's links bringing you to where uh, you want people to be. Okay, so let's experience Watson's. We're all familiar with Watson's. If I click shop now, okay, so it brings me to the site. 
and there has to be and now there's alert no i can block the notifications or or, or allow it so i'll block it so there for a big company like watson's there are what 2.9 million for followers currently and it's watsons.com.ph okay and then um, one of the things with digital too is there has to be a reason to buy and to buy now. So there's a, a benefit and there's a validity to it. Okay. So that's, again, uh, a way for uh, a company like Watson's to bring you to, to where uh, they want you, which is their website, information about them, for you to download the app. Okay, and this is coming from from Viber. No? And if we try to click it here, does it bring us to another site? So it's watsons.com.ph. So if you compare, this was the site earlier. And if you look at the the header, it's member announcements, okay? So it went to a page in the, in the website that's specifically what's, what, uh, what's the benefit to members, okay? The other one is really shopping online whether you're a member or not. So it's a different page altogether and it's a different link, okay? So if we go again back to Viber, there's a different one for call for delivery. Okay. So now this is focused to convince you that, hey, uh, and again, there are notifications that uh, uh, inform you that there are other things you can do. But here is the preparation for the lockdown. No? Because people can go out, they can deliver 10 to 4, here are the numbers to call. So para magic 8, no? Um, you can do that, uh, okay? So that's it coming from, from again, my filling up a loyalty card uh, on Watson, okay? Um, here, this service is approved by Viber. Um, let's learn a little more, so... Okay, so you can send business messages um, through Viber, and these are guides. Uh, again, this is a way for Viber to control uh, companies from misusing the service. Okay, so it's about, this is also a good thing, a good practice. It's like the outline page of the article. There are four parts. What are business messages? Then if you click to this link, it actually brings, this is the question, what are business messages? Click here, it brings you to the next section, brings you to the next section, and if you wanted to report something. Okay, so again, that's from Viber. Um, you focus from my, from my uh, side bar or side column, like, of course, I'm with A, so... Um, there are two types of uh, of uh, Viber communities that we have. So I'd like to look at Ace. Uh, this is the National Viber. Okay, the National Viber has five thousand two hundred uh, members. It's a one-way community, meaning it's uh, one way. It's just from the company going to its members. So it's written here only admins can send messages to the community, okay? Um, what's nice about this is um, these are all one-way announcements, so there's not much clutter, okay? But if you're a member from, say, Luzon or Mindanao, some of the announcements like here may not be relevant to you because this is just for a particular set of stores. Um, just for reference, right now, um, Ace has about 230 stores. Um, so all the announcements for the 230 stores will come out here. Uh, but it will not be so cluttered because um, 
uh, there are no um, interchange between members and the uh, owner, the community owner. You compare this with another one. Um, I'm based in SM in Cubao, the Ace Hardware in Cubao. So this has a community of 4,600 members. And these are members who are close to this particular branch or store. So the, the difference is it's being used uh, for interaction. So uh, let, let's just, okay. So this is a customer. This is a member here who will ask this question. Do you have this? What color? They will ask what price. Okay. Um, okay. There's a question and there's a response. Okay. So, so again, there's more interaction. Customers can post. So for those who have multi-branches, it's a common, uh, no, it's, it's a good strategy to have one national Viber and then one for each store so that each store can, can communicate to the community. So this is 4,600 people who agreed to be a member of the community who agreed to receive the messages. So uh, they're like your primary, primary, primary target market. So if you have a promotion or a communication without spending a lot, actually none, you reach this primary, primary target market. Okay, so that's how Viber is being used now. Um, they, they actually started with creating uh, a system and the platform that allows people to use Viber so that again now businesses can use Viber to communicate uh, to to um, to their members okay so so I'll, I'll stop there um, wait let's go back any questions on Viber so so it's a tool for all businesses okay um, you might want to, um, for those who have businesses, build a Viber community. Um, how to do that? You ask for phone numbers. Um, uh, the phone number is, why is a phone number very important? A cell phone number, especially as a digital tool. Anybody? Sir, because it's connected with your social media account. Yes. And your email. And your email, diba? Uh, you normally place it there. So, the, yes, that's one reason. Another reason? You always bring your phone anywhere. Bring your phone, right? Yes. So, whether you're on vacation, you're about to sleep, you're, you all, and what else? Aside from always being with you. You can pay with your phone, sir. Now you can pay with your phone, right? So, ano na rin siya? Wallet na rin siya. Okay. What else? Direct connection with the customer, sir. Oh, you know that if this is the number, it's Ryan who will answer this, not Tanya, right? And you know Ryan's profile. Okay? So, so Wapong, sobrang, sobrang targeted, di ba? Yung gusto ni Tanya, kay Tanya pupunta. But yung kay Ryan, kay Ryan mapapadala. Okay? So, um, ano pa? Mukhang uh, benefit of the phone. And the phone now is, uh, the term they use, it's the convergence of a lot of things. It's your calculator, it's your newspaper, it's your TV, it's your wallet, it's your uh, uh, timer, all of the things, no? So, Palette Dar, to-do list, files, music, Spotify, di ba? It's all there. Ano so, ba, sir? Ano, sir? Mirror. Mirror. <laughs> and one more thing. If you found value in this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, connect through my blog, or through LinkedIn, so together we can serve.